pop man you already know what time it is your boy mr j hill we live at rams here live in baltimore man my god jacques is in the building yeah yeah how you feeling dog feel good G. you told the stage up man yeah yeah thank you man ain't a thing man so first of all how how it feel been in the city man you been I here a few good. times yeah i fuck with baltimore i came here on tour same venue my first tour no nah, definitely man so uh first of all i want to say congratulations 100 million global spotify fans yeah. how, how does that feel for you that shit feel good bro as late i see you looking at the video yeah. and you did the soul training Award. that was your first award yeah. show yeah being inside Damn, that's congr congrats man how so how does it feel to hit 100 million global spotify man? it just feel good i can't wait till the album go like uh gold or platinum so is this something that you plan for when you when you create the album when you create your music are you planning are you planning to do these type of numbers or are you just doing it from the heart <clears throat> Now I'm planning to do numbers every time. You know what I mean? I'm just putting it out, though. No, I definitely. You know, and I always believe that my fans, the people that believe in me, that like my music, I always believe they're just going to eat it up. Right. So, like, I feel like you're one of the few R&B artists that's still putting on for R&B. Right. Thank you. But at the same time, I still feel like you ain't, you still ain't getting the recognition you deserve. Do you feel like, like how do you feel coming from the artist? Like, do you feel like... You, you getting the recognition you deserve, or you still think you still an underdog? I me? mean, I know for a fact people still questioning me because I know I just seen a message like before Soul Train, like somebody that we know they was like questioning, like, was I ready to perform on Soul Train? Somebody told them, like, y'all sleeping on the wrong one. You know what I'm saying? I ripped that shit apart. How long you been doing, like, for niggas to be sleeping on you? I just want to, you know what I'm saying? I like to have a real conversation, real candid. Like, how long you been doing this for niggas to still be sleeping on you? I feel like. It shouldn't be at now, this I've been point. doing it for a long time, but yeah. I mean, you know it'd be like that. You know, it's just, it is what it is. Like, I'm happy with the with the light, like, where I'm at. Mm -hmm. And I feel good in the space I'm in. No, oh, definitely. You feel me? So, what a, all right, I seen um you had an album with uh, Birdman. Mm -hmm. what, Lost That C2. Lost That C2. You just dropped that. What 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 is that about, if you don't mind getting into that? Yeah. We just lost on the island. We just making songs and shit. It's just a lifestyle. lifestyle. Nah, because I hear them, I see them like, all right, Jacquees and Birdman. I ain't really understand it at first sometimes. Oh, I'm cash money. No, nah, definitely. Yeah, so, I mean, that's just what it is. You're going to always see Jacquees and Birdman. Okay. You know what I'm oh. saying? Like, forever. As long as you see me, you're going to see Birdman. Nah, oh, definitely, man. Well, congrats for all your success, dog. Uh, I did want to ask you about, I want to know, just, what, what's the song, what song are we fucking up next? What, like, what, what song yeah. are we going to fuck up next? Oh, Queen Mix, Queen Mix, it's over for it for now. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Like, you know. I don't even know if I'm going to keep the series going because I feel like I just ended it with such a mat. Like, it just ended so big. It's like, shit, I might not even go back to that shit. Right. I might start a whole new series with some new shit. Like, it might be Queen Mix is on there, but the whole project ain't going to be a Queen Mix, you know what I mean? Right. Like, I'm going to start some new shit. I think Queen Mix 3 was, like, the finale. You know what I'm saying? I think I put my cap on it with Trip. No, nah, you did. No, nah, like, I wanted to get into that. Um, And it's not... First of all, we men, so it ain't no shade nowhere. Like, niggas don't even get into that messy shit, but... I'm curious. I don't think I've seen. I don't think I've seen a a remake or a cover that blew out of proportion like that ever. Like what? Did you? Did, were you thinking it was? I'm, I'm, well, of course I don't think you. Nah, you I think? knew that shit was gonna be that big. For real? Yeah, yeah. Hey, I told my brother that. I said, bro, this shit like I'm big. I DM the other man before I did. I said, I love it. So. That's respect. I mean, you can't. I mean, that's respect. Yeah, I fuck with y'all. She cool. Did y'all ever try? Did you ever try to like work out an official remix? Because I feel like why not? No, I couldn't get in touch with her. Damn, is it? Is and that... nobody that knew them tried to plug it, which they should have. You know what I'm saying? Damn, is that is that deep? It's the industry. You know what I'm saying? It's the game. I fuck with it, dog. Yeah. I fuck with it. I, I fuck with it for real, man. Um, well, like I said, congrats, much success, man. Keep doing your thing, bro. Thank you, bro. Anything. I man. appreciate it. Respect. Anything, Love. dog. One hundred, my nigga.